What's up guys, Video Games are here, and today I have two games for you because, well, you'll see. So, the first game we have is against the Rams, we're uh, the Steelers this time. Um, and when I look at this guy's roster, I feel like, oh wow, I must have felt like the last guy uh, used to play me. Because this guy, he had no one. Well, he had Antonio Brown, but that's it. Everybody else was like 50 to 80, he had no one above 88, and that was Antonio Brown. I'm like, okay, you know what? I'm just going to run the ball. I'm going to try not to celebrate to make this guy feel better. Ah, it, it just feels unfair to me. So, I'm giving the ball a lot to Thomas Rawls. By the way, we replaced Thomas Rawls. I'll show you with who. Uh, and I'm really excited to use this guy. Um, but I'll show you with who in the next video. Anyways, I pass it over the middle to Amari Cooper. And he gets a lot of yak yards after the catch. Just because that's what he does in real life and in, the, in this game. That was an accident, by the way. If you rewind that, you'll see that Thomas Rawls was, was, was supposed to like cut to the outside, not on a real wheel route, but he just didn't. He got caught up on the defender, so uh, I just passed it over to him, thinking that he'd slip by him, but guess not. Anyways, I passed it over the middle to Amari Cooper again, and he catches it with that new spec catch animation or whatever that we have this year. It's beautiful. And if you get a touchdown with Thomas Rawls, and then this guy is on, like, on the verge of quitting right now. Because he hasn't done anything so far. And then this would put the nail in the coffin. My user pick over the middle with uh, Freeman. Josh? Joseph Freeman? I don't know. Who's a new guy? Anyways, he quits. All right, on to the next game. This guy has a much better team than the last guy. This guy was, I don't know, if I could guess, maybe like a 95 to 96 overall. Maybe even a 97. He had a lot of good players. I mean, just look at this roster. That is redonkulous absolutely redonkulous um and he had marshall falk too he, he's gonna falk me um but he kept just running the ball and then on third down he'd always pass it right over the middle or do like a little impromptu out route on the left side every time it was super annoying because his wide receivers are so good and my cornerbacks aren't that good uh speaking of cornerbacks i got a brand new cornerback um who I'm also really excited about. We got a bunch of new additions. Um, so I blitz him. That was the outright I'm talking about. Is that Amari Cooper? Yep, that's the Amari Cooper. Anyways, I run it on first down. He misses the tackle with Ray Lewis. I get a few yards. Um, second and five, I decide to pass it back to Thomas Rawls. Um, usually, if I feel like someone has a really good team, I'm just going to send everybody up and make some room for the running back to do his work over the middle. There's Antonio Brown dodging and weaving his way up the middle for a good gain. Second and 12, I pass it over to, I think that's Amari Cooper again. Yep, that's Amari Cooper. Down to the five yard line. So I'm thinking, okay, I have a chance in this game. I don't know, I just, I always play better against really good teams. I make stupid decisions as you'll see later. Um, but yeah, anyways, now the game is tied up. He passes it out of the backfield to Marshall Falk again, who dominates this game. Um, he's gonna, is he, I read that, did you see that? But I got hit by him. If I didn't get hit, then that would have been a pick. And he passes over the, is that Antonio Gates? I'm just, I don't know. Oh, by the way, he always ran this on third, or second and third down. He always ran a toss to either the right or left side, so I ran commit, and I guessed it, and I got it right. So now he's only up by a field goal, 48 seconds left. So I put on my clutch little afterburner that I've always got. And before halftime, I want to see if I can get another touchdown to make it 14 to 10. So I get a really good return with Philly Brown. I thought I could take it all the way, but True Step kept me in bounds and slowed me down. So on third and 10, I pass it over the middle of Fi or, uh, Antonio Brown. It's confusing with the Browns. I don't know. They both look the same too, except for the number on their chest and back. Anyways, there's Philly Brown. I get out of bounds. No, I don't. I take a timeout. One last play. I send Green right up the middle because I knew that he would be wide open. And there we go, touchdown. So now it's 14 to 10 with, uh, oh, at the end of the second half, or the first half. And anyways, I get sacked on third down. I have to punt it all the way to him again. And there's Mar Marshall Falk again, falking me right in the booty hole. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I read this, or no, I read the guy over the middle, so he obviously had to take that little check down right there. As you can see, Aaron Rodgers is 10 of 11, but here we stop him on third down. And he decides to, uh, I think he goes for it. So I do a little, spe uh, the special teams chief. If you don't know what this is, you go out and punt block man. You man this wide, or the punt return right here. You put him next to the line. So you see he's going to run, he, he was going to toss it to the right side. And you usually get a free run at the quarterback if he doesn't pass it that fast. 
And you can see that I was coming unblocked, untouched. That happens almost every time, unless you go to the side where he blocks a running back. If Never go to the side that there's a running back on, because usually they will block you if you try to hit the quarterback. It's annoying, even if they're supposed to go out on a route. So, always go on the opposite side. Anyways, as you can hear, the music is it, coming. It's coming. Uh-oh. This is not good. Time to clutch! That was a heartbreak. I'm still kicking myself over that. Two days later, I'm still angry that I didn't kick my field goal and go into overtime and take my chances. Anyways, let me know you, what you guys thought about the editing and stuff. My little brother did that. Go to his channel. It'll be in the description. Uh, that's where he makes all the beats for this video and stuff. And this has been Video Gamester, and I'm out. See you next time.